Jessica came into the world on the 19th of March 1991. She has developed from the sweetest bundle of joy into a beautiful and successful young lady who knows her own mind and what she wants out of life. Now coincidentally, one of the members of the band and Jessica's first teenage crush was Matt, Matt Willis. And racking my brains to remember who else Jessica had plastered across the walls of her bedroom, I distinctly remember a certain poster, none other than David Tennant. one job. Now, doesn't he remind you of someone? <laughs> We met in Portsmouth over six years ago during a night out with some mutual friends. I knew there was something very special about Jess, so uh, I did what any man would do in my shoes. Looked around the room, looking for a prop. <laughs> Saw some playing cards, and uh, although having no previous training in magic, proceeded to <laughs> attempt some card tricks anyway. Um, obviously they all failed miserably. And uh, after my failed attempt, it did run through my mind that the, the irony of this gorgeous girl I fancied now doing a potential disappearing act uh, <laughs> after the magic tricks was something that I'd never lived down. At first, Jess shunned Matt's advances. Although Matt was not dejected, he carried on pursuing her without fear of being rejected. Eventually, Jess succumbed to Matt's pleas Mind you, he was so keen, he was virtually on his knees. <laughs> but uh, to my amazement, she didn't disappear. Um, we began talking more and more over the following months, and uh, six years later, she's still here. I met Matt for the first time when Jessica brought him to Dorset to introduce him to me and we went for a meal. Matt struck me as a devoted boyfriend who clearly adored Jessica. I could imme immediately see that he was kind and caring and was very much a gentleman with good manners. I promise to love and care for you, to give you all my loyalty and friendship, support and comfort, to respect and cherish you both now and for the rest of our lives together. Matthew, I promise to love and care for you, to give you my loyalty and friendship, support and comfort, to respect and cherish you both now and for the rest of our lives together. I feel that Matt is a good match for Jessica. They enjoy activities together such as travelling, going for walks and interior decorating. Allow each other to change and grow and don't forget to tell each other that you love them every day. Husband and wife, very, very It is nice to see how well Matt has fitted into our family. For someone to get up and go outside into the garden in the early hours and persistently call for one of my cats who stubbornly didn't want to come in, but eventually did whilst I was away, he certainly ticks my box. Um, and I really do feel like the luckiest guy in the world, honestly. Um, you know, Jess, not only are you my new beautiful, kind, funny and intelligent wife, um, you're also, you're also, <laughs> and I do see you as my best friend as well. And you always just make me want to be the best person that I can be in, yeah, I'm very thankful for that. Um, and yeah, just can't believe how lucky I am to have found you, um, and I will love you forever and always.
Um, <laughs> the feeling of the weight of promise I was. And I couldn't find. Jess is caring, attractive, and match shining light. I hope that their life together is just as bright. Matt often told me Jess was better than the rest, signaling the end to what seemed like a never ending quest. The man himself is an absolute legend. Our friendship has been great. He's loyal, caring, and fantastic company, and someone I'm proud to call my mate. Finally, if you'd like to be upstanding and join me in a toast to the married couple, wishing them joy and prosperity, I hope their wedded years bring happiness and longevity. To Matt and Jess. <laughs>